How's it going, everyone? I'm Jake uh, from the class uh, book project. I read Entre Leadership by Dave Ramsey. Here, um, this book is basically what it says. It's a combination of entrepreneurship and leadership. I mean, obviously, this class was about entrepreneurship and not leadership. Uh, but I wanted to read the book because, uh, let's face it, I'm not an entre entrepreneur. Um, so I wanted to re learn about leadership in a business sense, um, but also learn about entrepreneurship in a leadership sense. Um, so this class it was uh, something I wanted to do, and this book was something I wanted to read. Um, Dave Ramsey, uh, he's a New York Times best-selling author. Uh, he's written tons of books uh, on financial matters. Uh, Financial Peace University is something he founded. I actually partook in that class. Um, it was very good about teaching you how to deal with money and uh, different programs you can do to stick to your finances, you know, live within your means, that kind of thing. Um, so yeah, this book is 15 chapters long, 305 pages. Um, a good portion of it is uh, on money and leadership. Um, but like I said, this class is about entrepreneurship, so I'm going to mainly focus on that. Um, the big concept on this book is about passionate action, uh, which what that means is, you know, you start your business and you have goals. Your your goals should be your business's goals. You know, uh, when you start your business, you're the, the leader in your business, and so you need to make it clear to whoever you're working with, I don't know if it's just you or if it's just um, you know, a couple employees, something like that, your goals need to be clear, concise, and approachable. Um, a quote that was in the book was, a good plan violently executed now is better than a perfect plan next week. Um, and that is all about making decisions, uh, which is actually the second main concept of the book. Um, Oftentimes, when you start your business, you are weary of making decisions, and it, it, you put it off for too long, so long that you end up losing time and money, uh, which is not good, obviously, in your business. Um, there are, you know, obviously a few setbacks of not making decisions, one of them being fear or criticism, that type of thing. Um, and Dave Ramsey's uh, point on that is to not let the fear and criticism uh, let you make decisions while being under the influence of fear, that kind of thing. You need to clear your mind and think about it rationally before you make a decision. Um, weigh the risks, that kind of thing, before you start your business or make a decision in your business, uh, which leads to having a value set. Um, you, know, you have to think about making decisions, but oftentimes your decisions aren't always clear. Um, and having a set of values will help make that clear. Um, and that will help you become a good decision maker. Uh, and one of the ways to do that is to think about the worst case scenario. Um, if the benefit outweighs the cost in the worst case scenario of your decision, do it. Um, the third main concept uh, is about selling or marketing of your business. Um, oftentimes when you start your business you you get caught up in the buying equipment and uh, getting your office chairs, getting your paper, getting your computer, all this stuff set up and buying what you need to buy before you actually even test your market. Uh, Dave talks about testing your market before you even start your business. You know, Google has a program where you can actually test your market for free. You don't have to spend thousands of dollars on developing prototypes or um, spending money on that kind of thing. What you can do is just use the program in Google, see if it uh, is something that you can make money at, and if it's something that you can make money at, then you can go on to the step of buying what you need to do in order to get your business started. Uh, so those are the three main concepts. Um, like I said, another big part of the book was about money and people, um, but those are dealing with leadership and we're in the entrepreneurship class. So, hope you liked the video. Uh, thanks for watching.